Anacom PC and Marisol Mistaniclu are a 90-day fiancé season 7 couple who have dramatically transformed their relationship since appearing on the show. When the U.S. mother met Marisol, the duo was unable to communicate without a translator. However, Anna and Marisol have defied the odds to not only remain happily married but to have thriving businesses outside of the 90-day fiancé franchise. 90-day fiancé fans watched as Marisol embraced Anna's children and learned how to be a stepfather on screen. The duo is now expecting their first child together via surrogacy. Though some viewers thought that the enormous language barrier between Anna and Marisol would signal the end of their relationship, they have learned how to grow as both a couple and business partners. Marisol joined Anna in her beekeeping business though he recently announced he opened up his own furniture store as well. This makes Anna and Merzl one of the most successful franchise couples. Some fans took to Reddit in order to give Anna and Merzl a shout-out. Remember this couple. They have two businesses now, still together, and expecting a baby. Bravo, clapping emoji. The original poster captioned a photo of them. When Merzl joined beekeeper Anna in the US, he helped her run Beauty and the Bees Honey. However, Anna announced last week that her husband has just launched Merzel's custom furniture website. Merzel has over two decades of experience in custom furniture designing and building. He now offers customer furniture pieces based out of Bellevue, Nebraska. Meanwhile, Beauty and the Bees Honey has expanded to sell breast milk products that contain breast milk from customers to offer personalized natural products for their newborns. Many Reddit commenters praised Anna and Merzel for how far they have come while plenty of commenters shared why they supported the couple. They are probably my favorite couple from the shows. Sure their storyline was a little boring, but sometimes I just want to watch two folks in love bring their lives together. Very happy for them, one commenter wrote. Some fans pointed out that other franchise couples should follow Merzel and Anna's example of how to lead a healthy marriage. The older Americans seeking foreigners the same age as their kids should be taking notes. If you want a successful marriage, find someone you have similar interests with not someone you just want to sleep with," another commenter wrote. The fact that they went from only being able to communicate with an app to this is amazing, a fan responded. While many 90 Day Fiancé viewers had their doubts about Anna and Merzel, fans are happy to see that they proved them wrong. The Turkish-American duo now represents one of the only 90 Day Fiancé franchise couples who started their relationship on translator apps and were able to stay together. In contrast, other couples such as Paul and Karina Stale, Devin Clegg, and Jihoon Lee, and recently Mike Burke and Jimena Morales Queller have all broken up. Fortunately, this 90 Day Fiancé duo learned how to grow together and thrive in their personal and professional lives as a team. Source, Reddit.